shit, you fucking killed her, dude! <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh my god, I feel like I'm- Honestly, I thought it would take longer than this, but we're back with the Northern Ireland team, and we're back to review in form Johnny Evans for his performance against Italy in a nil-nil draw, which we should have won for fuck's sake, Connor. I don't think you're getting off lightly, Stuart. But it was a great performance from the lads and a great result. Johnny Evans has got an in form. He's 86 rated now. He's got the same pace he had in his base card last year. He's also got the same card that he had last year already. Maybe we can get more. Maybe he'll have more standout performances for Leicester. Who knows? Who knows? But yeah, I generally thought it would take a lot longer than this for us to get our first special card. But nah. It's only been about... Oh, just over a month. And we're back. In from Johnny Evans. Let's get into it. What's this team like? Okay, it's... Average Premier League team, I guess. Why don't you have second form, Sar? You bitch. So yeah, um, I'm just editing the footage for this game now, and I am extremely far away from my mic. You can barely hear me. So, I've decided to do this commentary post-match. Like, an actual commentator. Let's see how this goes. It's Bruno Fernandes on the ball now. Will he go to dive in the box to win a penalty? No, he'll dribble past Paddy McNair, and the game will lag, and he'll go on and shoot! But it's a great save from Bailey Peacock Farrell! Spoiler alert, that happens a lot. The Green One Army have a free kick. This is definitely Gareth McCauley territory, but it's a horribly taken, and De Bruyne has got it. He passes it to Sterling, and De Bruyne looks away here. He'll try to dribble, he passes it to Fernandez on selfish like. Here's Bruno Fernandez. surely he'll score! It's another great save, surely Sterling! Oh, how has Sterling not got it? How has Sterling not got there in time? And Michael Smith dispossesses him. That's a wasted opportunity. Here comes the counter-attack, it's Josh McGuinness. He looks to be away now. This is end-to-end -end stuff. He'll try to play a ball. It's blocked by Varane. But Varane gives it right back. And then he gives it right back again. It's Josh McGinnis. Oh! How unlucky. How did both teams not score there? Well, Lewis has picked up the ball now. And he plays it. Here's Jordan Jones. We know he can dribble. But can he whip a ball in? Yes, he can. Oh, it's blocked and cleared. But McGinnis has picked up the scraps. Oh, but it's truly a dead chance now. Jamal Lewis picked up the ball here, he's played a lovely ball again to Jordan Jones, who could be away here. McGinnis running into the box, and try for McGinnis, but it's well defended by Laporte. It's Stephen Davis, the captain, who's found himself in a lot of space here. What can he do with it? He'll pass to Jordan Jones. Jordan Jones, the keeper comes out. Jones! Oh, the keeper gets there first. It's a great goalkeeping, but Jones has to shoot quicker. The visitors are pushing up here with Andrew Robertson. He'll try and whip the ball in. No, he'll pass it out to, back to a Bobby Yang. Oh, it was audacious, but it wasn't far out at all. The ball's with Pierre McAbamary Yang. Oh, lovely little trickery, but what was the point of it? He'll pass it to Fernandez. Back to Bobby Yang. Back to Fernandez. Surely Fernandez. Great save, Benny Peacock Farrell. As the chance isn't out here, Sterling's got it, but it's cleared now. Here comes a Turner attack with Stuart Dallas leading the way here for the Green and White Army. But he'll be dispossessed. And the counter attack again. A Bobby Yang. Part of the trying to close him down. But here's Pogba. But another great save from Benny Peacock Farrell. Stuart Dallas now trying to get the first attack of the second half here for the Green and White Army. Josh McGuinness. He'll cut back. Josh McGuinness with the finesse. It's a great effort. Great save. But Davis should have finished it. Ashford Quet will try and play it out from the back. Plays it to Pogba. And Pogba's been dispossessed by Stuart Dallas in a dangerous area. Stuart Dallas now. He's finding some space. Across it into McGinnis, surely! Oh my word, how has McGinnis missed that? That's the miss of the season. McNair will play it out to Davis. Davis now. Oh, Laporte has dispossessed him. Here's De Bruyne. A Bobby Yang. A Bobby Yang! Great save again from Bailey Peacock Farrell. Unbeatable today. Here's a header, and it goes over. It's Jordan Jones, who gets rid of the ball to Dallas just before losing it. Dallas trying to find some space, and he'll take on a shot, but it drifts wide. That was very similar to his shot against Italy. Ashman Aquetta now. 
Playing it to Pogba. Pogba passes it straight to Dallas. And Dallas gives it to Jones. He gives it to McGuinness. Laporte runs into McGuinness. And then runs into him again. What's Laporte doing? The keeper's out. And McGuinness. It's perfect. It's a perfect chip. But what was Laporte doing? And Sterling is outpacing Michael Smith here. Sterling, he'll cut it back to De Bruyne, De Bruyne to Fernandez. Fernandez trying to look for the shot, but Evans has blocked him. But Fernandez got it right back to De Bruyne. De Bruyne with the effort, and Bailey Peacock Farrell again will not be beat. It's a remarkable display from the Sheffield Wednesday goalkeeper. And Dallas picks up the ball in the great area, he loses it, but he somehow gets the block, and he's Gavin White, and a save for Edison. Relatively simple. The away team are running out of time here. Only 10 minutes to go. Sterling to Aubameyang. Aubameyang crosses. Saar! Oh, how has he not hit the target at least? Seven minutes to go here. Saville to Davis. Back to Saville. Saville gives it back to Davis. Davis goes on a sprint. How has he gone past Davis? Oh, but Edison comes out and clatters it. But the chance isn't over yet. Northern Ireland get the ball back. It's Davis. Trying to find a way, he's found Smith, but the defense, Sterling has got it, and here's another counter. But the pass from De Bruyne is horrible, but Savile's missed the header. The substitute may cost them here. Here's Sturt Robertson, but Savile covers for Ferguson's mistake. There's three minutes to go, but the, hot, but the away team are still in need of a goal here. De Bruyne, in the box now, a Aubameyang, surely he'll shoot. But no, Evans, the man of the hour, gets the block in. Davis looks for a counter to McGuinness. And here is a counter. He gives it back to Davis now. Davis, the 36 year old, with a lovely sprint. Shoot! Oh, but it's tackled last second. There's a minute to go from the two added on. And another counter. But Evans wins it again and he clears it, but it's a poor clearance. An attack from Savile. It's considered a foul. The referee will blow. But surely that's it, two minutes have been played. Need to catch my breath. Paddy McNair headers it away. Davis clears the ball. Surely the ref's got to call it. Ashman Aquetta will get there first. And the referee has blown it now. And that is it. Queen and Army are 2 0 in FIFA 22. So yeah, uh, that was a neat experiment. My voice generally does hurt now after doing that though. But yeah. Johnny Evans, the man of the review, he played really well, but Bailey Peacock Farrell did outshine him with his miraculous saves. But yeah, uh, the man of the review, Johnny Evans, played really well defensively. Uh, clearing the ball isn't a strong suit, but getting it is definitely something you can do with this card. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I know this is a little bit different. Uh, I'm probably not going to do this again unless I make the mistake again, or maybe if you guys like it and want me to keep going with this format. But uh, for now, I'm going to stick with my tried and true uh, commentate while playing my, uh, live commentary, which I just prefer. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all next time. I know it's been a while, I apologize. Peace out.